Hello everyone, this is Stephen Lightfoot, the Technical Director for Peter Coppola Beauty. I'm excited today to show you guys the steps to accomplish our Peter Coppola's Keratin Concept Keratin Treatment, an effective method to achieve smooth hair in the salon. This formaldehyde and aldehyde-free formula releases no off gases, no carcinogenic effects, and nothing that your salon environment will dislike. Be sure to have a thorough client consultation before you begin this service. During your consultation, ask about your client's complete hair history to determine if this treatment is right for them. Ask about all previous hair color or chemical services, including home color or henna. Do not guarantee results if home hair color or henna has been used. If your client's hair is not in a condition where you would do a high heat service such as this, do not proceed. Assessing the hair properly will help you determine the proper processing time, iron temperature, as well as give you the best results. These are the tools that you will need to successfully accomplish your keratin treatment. The Peter Coppola Keratin Concept Smoothing Treatment itself, the Peter Coppola Keratin Concept Clarifying Shampoo, one tint bowl, tint brush, clips, the Peter Coppola Keratin Concept Fine Tooth Tail Comb, a flat iron that can reach 450 degrees, unscarred plates and in great condition. Brushes of your choice, paddle, vent or round, blow dryer, the Peter Coppola Keratin Concept Argen Oil or High Definition Gloss, gloves, cape, towels, and your model or client. Here is a brief overview of the Peter Coppola Keratin Concept Keratin Treatment. Step one, shampoo the client's hair. Step two, towel dry. Step three, Part the hair into four sections and apply the product. Step four, process. Step five, rinse the client's hair. Step six, blow dry the client's hair. Step seven, flat iron into place. In step one, you will shampoo your client's hair. Shampoo the hair thoroughly once. Do your best to avoid over manipulation of the scalp. If the client has an excessive buildup of product, such as silicones, feel free to shampoo twice. After the hair has been completely cleaned, Towel dry. Squeeze the hair with a towel and do not rub the hair in an abrasive fashion. Try to avoid any unnecessary damage to the hair shaft. Make sure that your tools are laid out properly and are easy to access. Shake the Peter Coppola Keratin Concept treatment bottle well and pour two ounces of product into your tint bowl. Section the hair into four simple sections. Front hairline to the nape of the neck, and then the apex of the head to just behind the ear on each side of the head. This gives you easy access for application. After the hair is in your touch-up sections, starting at the back right section, pull down one inch of hair and begin applying the product just off the scalp through the ends of the hair. Use a fine tooth tail comb to comb the product into each section. As a tip, make sure that there is complete hair coverage and no excess product dripping from the hair. Continue to apply to the back right section, moving up one inch at a time to the apex of the head. Then move to the back left section, front right, and front left sections of the head until complete. Make sure that this is done in an organized fashion. Proper saturation is key. All of the hair must have product applied to it for the product to perform correctly. After the product has been applied, process the client's hair according to the hair's condition. The processing time can be as little as 20 minutes for hair that is damaged, bleached, double processed, heavily highlighted, or previously relaxed. You may process up to 50 minutes for hair that is virgin, very coarse, very thick, or has a very heavy curl pattern. Comb the hair smooth every five minutes of processing with your fine toothed comb. As a pro tip, if your client has a very heavy curl pattern and the hair is in excellent condition, you may place them under a medium temperature hood dryer with the hair capped for the first 10 minutes of processing. Then remove the cap and comb the hair into a smooth position for the remainder of the processing time, up to 50 minutes total. After your client has finished their processing time, take them back to the shampoo bowl and rinse the hair thoroughly with warm water until the water runs clear, approximately three minutes. After the client's hair has been thoroughly rinsed, bring them back to the chair. Blow dry the hair 100% into your desired shape using either a round, 
vent, or paddle brush. As a tip, if the client has a heavy curl pattern, use a round brush to increase the tension on the hair. This will help ensure a smooth result. After the hair has been blow dried 100%, section the hair appropriately for the flat ironing portion of this process. The four section touch of parting is a good starting point. If the client has a great deal more hair than average, section the hair according to the density. When flat ironing the client's hair, take a 1 8 inch section starting at the nape and pass smoothly from roots to ends between 3 and 8 passes. Make sure the hair is completely smooth and frizz free. Pay close attention to the root area during ironing as it is the most tightly curled. Also keep in mind that if the client's density is less than average, then you can increase the partings up to 1 quarter of an inch. The flat iron should be set at a temperature appropriate to the texture of each client's hair between 350 degrees and 430 degrees Fahrenheit. If the client's hair is compromised, fine, heavily processed, or they're just looking to remove frizz, keep the iron on the lower end of the spectrum. If the client has virgin, coarse, very dense, or very heavily curled hair, raise the temperature up to 430 degrees. After you've completed the ironing process, the treatment is complete. If there are any residual flyaways, feel free to apply a couple of drops of Arjan oil or high definition gloss to the hair to smooth and condition the ends. As a pro tip, remember not to color or highlight your client's hair until 24 to 48 hours post-treatment. Well, as you can tell with our beautiful model Stephanie, her hair is exceptionally beautiful. It was before, but now we have it smooth, defrizzed, and perfect. Um, it's light and airy and completely wearable. She's gonna be able to flat iron it, curl it, wave it, do whatever she wants tomorrow. The versatility of the treatment is key. I couldn't have asked for better results. 85% frizz reduction over the life of the treatment. When she air wears it, she's gonna be perfect and smooth and that's what we wanna see. Thank you everybody so much for taking the time to watch. I hope that it's been informative and you're able to give your client the sleek, beautiful, defrizzed hair that they're looking for.